How did the Weather Service determine that this was, in fact, a tornado? Jeff, I spoke with the meteorologist from the National Weather Service who came down to Tippecanoe County from Indianapolis today, and he told me he was looking at the way the trees fell. Out here in the Red Oak subdivision off of South 9th Street on the south side of Lafayette, you can see that the trees have fallen helter-skelter out here. And the meteorologist says there are two types of damage right now in Tippecanoe County. Straight line wind damage, where all the trees would be lying in the same direction, and tornado damage, where that is much much more chaotic and there's no pattern to how those trees fall. Meteorologist Dave Tusek says both types of damage are caused by winds whipping at high speeds. At this point in time, I, I'm sure that our winds were over 100 miles an hour that impact this area. How much stronger than that is hard to say. And we just got confirmation from the National Weather Service recently that the winds were estimated at 135 miles an hour for that tornado. Now, I've spoken with some of the homeowners out here, and they say that the damage is just incredible. A lot of people have been driving by to take a look at it, and people are very busy trying to get their driveways and lawns cleared of all the branches and trees. So they ask if you come by to take a look at what happened, please stop and help.